Hey Tiger! Aren't you excited for our lesson? Today we're going to hike further and learn the order of operations. Wow! This sounds really challenging. Yes, it is. But fun too if you learn the right way to do it. So, are you ready? You bet! Order of operations Introduction Operations mean things like add, subtract, multiply, divide, squaring, etc. When you see something like 5 times 2 plus 3, there are two ways to solve this. The first is to multiply and then add. So 5 times 2 is 10 and 10 plus 3 equals 13. The second way to solve this is to add 2 and 3 which is 5 and multiply with 5 which equals 25. But we know in math there can only be one right answer. The easy way to remember the order of operations is bird mass. B brackets first. Do everything inside the brackets first. O. Orders. That is powers and square roots. If you don't know what these are, don't worry about them for now. D. M. Division and multiplication rank equally, left to right. A. S. Addition and subtraction rank equally, left to right. So the right answer for 5 times 2 plus 3 if we use board mass, we'll be going from left to right and it will be first multiply and then add. So the answer is 10 plus 3 equals 13. If we change it to 5 times 2 plus 3, if we use board mass, we will be going from left to right. First add since it is in the brackets and then multiply. So the answer is 5 times 5 equals 25. Solve this. 6 times 2 plus 4. Let's use bird mass to solve this problem. We first look for brackets. There are no brackets. Let's ignore order for now. Next, we look for division or multiplication since both rank equally. We have multiplication. 6 times 2 equals 12. This becomes 12 plus 4. Next, we look for addition or subtraction. We have addition. 12 plus 4 which equals 16. So the answer is 16. Solve this. 3 times 2 plus 5. Let's use board mass to solve this problem. We first look for brackets. We have 2 plus 5 in the brackets which equals 7. This becomes 3 times 7. Let's ignore order for now. Next, we look for division or multiplication since both rank equally. We have multiplication. 3 times 7 equals 21. So the answer is 21. So Tiger, did you understand? Oh yes, I did. But I need to practice more to feel more confident. Well, lots of practice is coming up. Hang on tight.